Do you remember this pop culture moment? Don't you wanna dance up on me? After the show ended in 1994, Britney was pitched to multiple record labels after recording her demo, a Whitney Houston cover. Record labels claimed that they wanted more girl groups like the Spice Girls and that Britney wouldn't be another Madonna. But the president of Jive Records signed her and ordered a whole album after shaping her voice to be distinctly Britney, aka the famous baby voice. During March and April of 1998, Britney recorded her debut album, Baby One More Time in Stockholm, Sweden. When she returned to the States, she embarked on a mall tour to promote the upcoming release of her album before opening for NSYNC on their second world tour. On January 12th, 1999, Baby One More Time was released and debuted at number one on the Billboard Hot 100. During her Baby One More Time tour, Britney stirred up some controversy over her quote-unquote racy outfits. The media was obsessed with Britney being the girl next door that was an all-American Christian type. 